I came from a tiny village in the northern Italy. Since I was really young, I loved to build things. And computer science was a way to build things that would help yourself and other people. I came here to follow my passion, combining computer science and biology. My role is basically bringing together scientists in all kinds of disciplines in the life sciences or biomedical sciences. A colleague of mine had met uh, Nicola in the south of France at a workshop. He already seemed to be able to combine computer science and the life sciences, and we decided to hire him. Me and Yap met Bertolt Gottgens, which is a professor at the University of Cambridge. So he was trying to understand how different genes in blood cells interact with each other and might lead, for instance, to diseases such as leukemia. We developed the tool called Combine to try to understand how different genes can regulate each other. When we developed Combine, we were wondering whether we could apply the same technique that we use in leukemia or in agritech. Therefore, we contacted Keygene and they were excited about it. Keygene does research to support seed breeding companies to develop new and improved crops, higher yield, better nutritional value to their crops. We're excited to work with Nicola to see if the combine tool can be applied to plant genomics. Currently, we're only looking at genes themselves. With this tool, we're also looking outside the genes. How do other parts of the genome, of the DNA, affect a certain trait? It gives us more insight in how genes work. We can provide this knowledge to the plant breeders to help them make better crops. I wanted to make this tool available for other people to use. Since the beginning, it was clear for us that Azure would provide the scalability and robustness necessary to deliver combined as a research as a service. We created Empicum because we saw that there was not enough software engineering in life science, and we wanted to empower life scientists with innovative tools that use state-of-the-art software engineering. The challenge of this century is transforming life science in an engineering process. And to do that, you need to bring engineering into life science. And Although probably I would not see the end of this journey, I would like to participate.